just start going down. <laughs> Why didn't it want to go down? because it went up and down. You think it's a weight? Well, because it's under tension. Yeah. It should allow it to come out even under tension. You're saying you should be alright using the in and out when it's under pressure. Solenoid sticking. Oh look Dan, 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 whoa, 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 are you going up? It's got tangled at the top. Right now. Good morning. Well, one is up and it was, it went fine, but now we know what to streamline. The second one's gonna go up so smoothly. Hold it, round the back, back under itself. The idea is it tensions up, it pulls tight.
Right, Sean. Well, that's both the I-beams in. It went, look, that went pretty smooth. So we're kind of thinking ahead and thinking, is there any more steel we need to get up? And there is some for the middle bit where I was building the arches. So we're going to get that up now. Well, that's all the bits of steel up here now, all using the same method, winching it up through this big opening and onto the landing. So now we're here, I can use this lifter to lift everything up onto the next level. I told you it'd be easy, it just needed a bit of engineering. So tomorrow, first thing in the morning, me and Nick are gonna put the C section up against a new rebuilt wall and then I can finish this section of floor. So I bought this steel section up and the steel section for the other wall when that's rebuilt and some more for the top. So trying to like think ahead, get all the steel up here. Now it's all on this level. I can use the lifter to get it up to the next level. Now we've got the winch. What a game changer. Anyway, 
there's going to be a lot of progress in the next few days. So I will see you tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs>